Welcome back to chapter 45 of Kaguto Bachi. Glad to see we are still going strong. We left off with young Chihiro wanting to join up with the organization. A huge plot twist. He's lost both swords. Let's see where it goes from here. It's all going smoothly as we predicted. The Kamunabi will now take possession of the Shinuchi. Right. They really have no other option. There's nothing they can do. They're playing right into our hands. Yes. Time for our next move. Kagurubachi chapter 45. What comes next? <coughs> oh, oh ho. Perfectly in sync. Where where are we? Good morning, you two. Oh, my head. How are you feeling? So, what comes next? Hmm. You both crashed from exhaustion at the same time, too. What are you, twins? It's 11 in the morning, the day after the Raku Zaichi. It's November 9th today. What are you doing? Die! Die! Beep, beep, beep. Oh. You took forever waking up. Don't worry, though. We weren't bored. Good morning. This video game freak kept us entertained. All night. I creamed him. Who are you anyway? Guess they don't know. He's ex Kamunabi. What about the prisoners? They all went home. Oh, I have a message for... You, from Inazuma. He says, thank you. <laughs> thank you. I Inazuma? Mr. Inazuma. That's what that kid at the Rakuzaichi called himself. Thanks, Char. Sure. Mr. Inazuma. Cool name. Anyway, everyone's okay. Hmm. Normally, it's the Kamanabi's job to keep the peace and protect the vulnerable. But the fact is, evil still runs rampant in Japan. It's because a Kamanabi doesn't have the necessary manpower and grit. Yesterday, thanks to you guys, we pulled off the entire operation seamlessly. Mm. Yeah, but those were some insane shenanigans. This is pointless. Let's withdraw. No. Maybe we should withdraw for now to regroup. No. Hey. Hey, stop. You're already at your limit. For real. Every last one. <sighs> All of it. I'm just glad you're okay. Sorry. Where's the intent? Shh. I entrusted the Shinuchi to some colleagues. They're at Kamunabi headquarters. The colleagues. I'll take you there now. So get ready. I heard about your deal. You give them the Shinuchi. And you join the Kamunabi. <sighs> so your priority is to reseal the Shinuchi. That makes sense. <sighs> but are you sure about this? You met one of those Hishaku guys, huh? Mm. Yeah. I get why you're anxious, but that's exactly why we need to make our moves next carefully. For the past three years, the Hishaku have been making meticulous preparations we can't even fathom. If their goal was to, for the Kamunabi to take possession of the Shinuchi, then that means... They have their next move already planned. There are other ways we could prepare, right? Without joining the Kamunabi. Hey, hold up. What kind of garbage is that? Other ways? It's already been decided. He's coming with me to the Kamunabi. Get ready to leave. Plus, you seem to take it for granted that the Kamunabi will seal the Shinuchi. But that's for the higher-ups to decide. There are alternatives to sealing it. 
like using it. I get it. That's another problem. If the idea is to sh seal the Shinuchi, we have to hand it over to the Kamunabi. But there are too many concerns. That's why we should talk it out and eliminate as many as possible. What would be the Kamunabi's motivation for using the Shinuchi? The Kamunabi have uh, the swords, masters. And the thieves have the enchanted blades. With the Shinuchi's power, we could break the Kamunabi's deadlock with the Hishaku. We can never let anyone use it again. If I can show you another way to break the deadlock, then there's no need for the Kamunabi to use the Shinuchi. You're right, Mr. Shiba. Maybe I am rushing into this. But this isn't just a stab in the dark. Now, I've got Hakuri. What? Hmm. What's the strategy? We steal back the enchanted blades from the Hishaku. Huh. Hmm. Hakuri can freely transport registered items and items affiliated with them. For example, if he registers me, he can transport the Enten from another location. Register! They just have to be connected by spirit energy, and an eternal contract meets that standard. In other words, if Hakuri makes contact with the sword bearers in Kamunabi custody, he can transport the enchanted blades. So, sword bearers? Hmm. The people Kunashige Rokuhira chose. Doom. Doom. To entrust with the enchanted blades. Doom. Doom. How can we get to them? With the exception of the sword master, the bearers of the enchanted blades are hiding out in Kamunabi controlled locations throughout Japan. If they die, then the enchanted blades, the Hishaku's hands become usable. So. They're heavily guarded. Most of the Kamunabi's forces are invested in protecting them. Only the Tapara Brass can access authorized to them. They're located in fortresses known as Sanzo. Senku Suji Temple. Kokugoku Hot Spring. Kuen Taisha Shrine. Sushi Subaru. Cool, cool. It just sounds cool. To ensure absolute security, most of our people are stationed there. That's the reason we're shorthanded. The bulk of our forces are tied up. Mm. That's why we have to pick our battles. So... If, if we get the enchanted blades back, then the Kamunabi will be freed up, and those people we set free yesterday can live in a safer world, right? The world will definitely be significantly safer. That clinches it. Let's go see the sword bearers. Hakuri, I'm gonna need your help again. You got it. Don't yell. Stealing the enchanted blades back from the Hishaku is an excellent proposal. Nothing beats that. But it won't be easy. First, you'll be judged on the basis of your character and trustworthiness. You can't prove who you are other than a guy who's been wielding an enchanted blade and his pal. As far as the higher-ups are concerned, there's no telling what you'll do if they let you meet the sword bearers. There's no guarantee they'll let you on board. In fact, you could end up seriously punished. <sighs> Prove yourselves. Mm. State your name. Chihiro Rokuhira. To be continued. Epic, epic chapter. Love the next setup. Very excited to see where this goes. If you guys enjoyed that, please leave a like, leave a comment, and I'll see you on the next chapter. Peace.
Boah. 